I have so many random little Minecraft toys that Mattel and Jazzwares have sent me. That's a new one right there, and that guy is a new one right there. The spider jockey. Oh, baby. Hey, guys. Ant from here, and welcome back to another sort of vlog video. And in today's vlog, I actually want to just kind of discuss with you guys uh, about some of the things that have been going on and just my mindset on, like, Minecraft videos as of lately and just where I see things going, I guess. So... Uh, as you guys have probably noticed, I haven't been releasing super consistent daily videos or anything like that. Actually, as of about the past week or so, I've been releasing videos about every other day. And that's just because, I don't know, I think I'm like subtly losing interest in the idea of like just searching up the Minecraft forum and seeing something cool to record and then going at it from there. Uh, Minecraft videos in that style, I'm really just not digging it anymore, really, at all. That's not to say I'm sick of making Minecraft videos. I like doing videos where I have a lot of, you know, post work on them. Uh, more specifically, the In Vanilla Minecraft series, like, you know, the, uh, what do you call it? Um, the, the Exploding Arrows in Vanilla Minecraft and Time Travel in Vanilla Minecraft. I like videos like that. I like videos with the idea of Seed Wars, but that video did not do well at all. Like, doesn't really seem like anybody enjoyed it. So, you know, that one's probably not going to come back. But the In Vanilla Minecraft series definitely will. I'm definitely considering doing some, uh, you know, like top videos or videos showcasing things like, you know, top five theme builds or top five like features and all that because I know a lot about the game. I feel like I can use that knowledge to make something actually interesting rather than just letting the knowledge sit dormant in my mind. But anyways, uh, the real point of me making this video is the fact that I wanted to talk to you guys about the fact that I am going to be starting daily live streams, at least for two weeks, and then I'm going to have to like be a little bit sporadic about it because I have travel going on in mid-January. Uh, I'm going to be starting daily live streams tomorrow, on Monday. Uh, this is going to be mostly Minecraft in the beginning, but I don't want to run exclusively a Minecraft live streaming channel. Uh, and that channel will be twitch.tv slash antvenom. You guys have probably seen me stream on there before, but this time I'm doing it proper. I'm going to daily on this point. And the reason why I want to force myself to do daily, at least for two weeks, is to see what the concept, well, how it'll wind up going for me doing daily live streams where it's not necessarily me playing mini games the whole time because the problem with things like playing Minecraft mini games is that I can't really communicate with the chat at all. It's way too fast paced. I burn out really quickly, which is why the streams are so short. So I have two very primary ideas that I want to do for this uh, live streaming thing. And I just want to see if it's going to wind up working out, you know? And if at the end of the two weeks, it's something that I'm really not enjoying, then I won't resume it. But I'm looking for something new. I'm looking for the next step for me. And I've been spending way too many months just thinking about it you know, and wondering, oh, is it going to work? Is it going to work? Is it going to work? I've been falling into the same trap that the vast majority of people fall into when they first get started on YouTube. And that is, oh, I need to make my first video, but I don't know if it's going to work out. I don't know. I don't know. Uh, and I realized I've fallen into that trap. So in order to escape the trap, I'm going to be doing daily live streams. So again, follow me on Twitch. The schedule is going to be at least for this holiday weekend because this holiday or this holiday week because it's going to be going on for two weeks. Uh, I don't know what my schedule is going to be after the fact, but it's going to be 10 a.m. EST to 1 p.m. EST or 2 p.m. EST. It's going to be one of those two. So if I'm going to go three to four hours, it's going to start at 10 a.m. The only strict exceptions with that being is that uh, I can't do that on Christmas Eve. Or no, Christmas Eve. Can I do that? I think... On Christmas Eve, I'm going to have to stream a little bit earlier or just not stream as long. And on Christmas Day, I'm going to have to stream a lot later because all of my Christmas stuff for Christmas happens much later in the day. If there is even a stream on Christmas at all, that might be the only exception day. And then I'm going to be traveling to Toronto in mid-January, so I won't be able to do it then. But yeah, otherwise, I do want to stream every day, every single day, including weekends. I think if I do wind up making a schedule out of this, it's going to wind up being like... I'm going to wind up streaming every day except for like Monday or Tuesday or something like that because I think that would be good days to do that. I don't really know, but I also know that streaming at that schedule will mean that people who go to school like won't be able to catch the stream. So maybe I might stream later, but also streaming a lot later is, you know, really competitive uh, streaming time space. So like I'd be competing with everyone else. I don't know. We'll see. But for now, 10 a.m. to 2 p.m. EST. We'll see how that goes. And yeah, it should be a lot of fun, guys. 
I'm not saying that I'm like quitting YouTube or anything like that, but I'm looking for a new way to do it and just, you know, only looking to make content that excites me because I haven't made content that excites me for quite a while and the prospect of me doing this really kind of excites me. So I don't know guys, let me know in the comment section down below what you guys think, any thoughts you guys have and uh, yeah, I will see you guys on Twitch. See you later. Oh man, I gotta clean all this up at some point, but hey, Christmas.